but what can I do? I can't do anything. But together, all of us, all of us can do something. All of us can go to the voting booth and tell our government enough is enough. No more. You stop right here. We draw the line. No more such nonsense for the people of Singapore. So what is the solution? What is the solution for the, SD, uh, the SDP comes up with? Well, you know, there are many problems in our society and the SDP in our manifesto have come up with a solution and sometimes more than one for each of these problems. I would like you, I mean, I can tell you all the solution, but I would like you to go to our website, yoursdp.org. Okay? Go in there and you look at our manifesto. We have broken it up into 15 different issues and you will get solution for that 15 issues ranging from uh, economic, from uh, foreign workers, right down to environment and women issues. And so, go in there and take a look, but more than that, I want you to do this. Print them out and give it to your uncle, your, your aunt, your, your mom, your dad, your kong kong, your ama, who have no access to internet or doesn't know how to go in there. Show them, tell them about it, explain to them. Do your part because we can reach out to everybody even though we wanted to. But for tonight, I'm going to just pick one of these solutions. The solution to this foreign workers problem, the SDP says we must implement the Singaporean first policy. What it simply means is that an employer that wants to employ a foreign workers has to first give Singaporeans priority. You can find a Singaporean that fits the shoe, then you can go to a foreign workers. Then you can employ a foreign workers. But you have to show and demonstrate that you have tried. Now, some people say, it's like, oh, isn't that kind of difficult, really cumbersome? Well, not really, because many countries have that kind of policy. I live in America for 10 years. They do have that kind of policy. And these are countries I'm talking about that has got stronger economy than we have. So, why can't we just follow them? Not because we want to follow them for following sake, but they have a solution for this problem already. So it's a really a simple thing. So that is our solution for the people, for you, for us. But why does SDP think that way? Why do we come up with this solution? Why do we think this solution is good? It is because the SDP believe that as Singaporean, you must come first. The SDP believes that our economies is built by people like you, you, and you. Not foreigners who contribute to this society, who build this society up. We do. And Singapore has got talent. Don't let anyone tell you otherwise. 
We will import talents only when we need it, not just open the flood gate for everybody. There you go. Well, let me tell you what we can do to solve this problem finally. And it will be the beginning of the final solution. Here it is. If you like me, is fed up of having to watch over your job because somebody else comes along accepting a lower fee, a lower wage. If you are fed up of having to compete with dozens of others because they don't have reservist liability and you have and you lost out. If you are fed up of being treated like a second class in your very own country, there's only one thing you have to do. I think you know the answer already. Vote for the SDP. Thank you so much. Thank you, everyone. Thank you. Remember that when the day comes. And the day of reckonings is very near.